Hi, I'm Jack Bercanti again. Welcome back to our Fix It series. Uh, this, for the next seven days, we're going to try to help players learn to open their hips better. Uh, many kids uh, fail to use their lower half properly and fail to get the hips open, which is going to cause a myriad of problems. And we want to help them learn to do this correctly. So the first thing I want to do, though, is I want to make sure um, kids line up correctly and so their hips have a chance to open up better. So what I want you to do is I want you to get a couple pieces of boards like these or a 2x4 works fine and we're going to set them in line here with our feet to make sure that our feet are in line. So we can give them a little extra room but mainly our feet are going to be even squared up towards the pitcher here. So notice I have my pieces of wood lined up. And if I step in or I step back away, I'm going to knock the wood over. Okay, so if I step in too much and lock up the hips, I'm going to knock that piece of wood over. And obviously if I step away, all right, then the hips are going to be slow and the shoulders going to open up way too early. So we're going to use these pieces of wood to help our hitters keep their feet in line. And working on taking that step directly at the pitcher so my hips have a better chance of opening up to contact. Okay, so once we've done that, we're going to condition the hips first. Uh, by working just on the lower half hip turn and this is a age-old problem uh, and a drill that's been used for many years mainly to warm up but it's a nice drill to work on so once I have my feet in line we're going to set a ball on the tee and we want to put the tee about waist high and then just set the bat in behind the hitters in this manner here or they're holding on to the bat with both hands. So all we're going to do is work on taking our step, eyes on the pitcher, step, turn, and try to see the ball, see our, our bat make contact with the ball as the hips rotate. So notice my hips are going to turn. I should be able to hit line drives in the same manner as normal. So eyes on the pitcher, short stride, and then really work on that fast turn and when we turn, it's very important that we have our hitters uh, see, the, see the contact. And that's often the hardest part of hitting is to make contact with the ball but keep the head down, okay, and on the ball. Most hitters turn, but when they turn, their head lifts up and they come flying off the ball. So our first drill is very basic and once again, more of a warm-up drill, but it really makes the point of forcing the hips to rotate and the head to stay down. So it's stride, hip turn. Thanks for listening, and we'll have a drill every day for seven days here to help hitters learn to rotate those hips and condition that lower half to drive the baseball. Thanks for tuning in. We'll see you tomorrow.